we are going to compare Azac PVC Deccan and Fiberon's PVC Deccan. We haven't met before. I'm Ryan by DexbyE3.com. We're going to talk to see which one's best one for you. If you like what you see, give her a thumbs up. We're going to compare appearance, durability, traction, price, and warranty of them all. Before we talk deck, let's talk deck and companies. Azec was started in 1983 as a PVC company for exterior construction. In 2007, they launched their PVC Deccan. And their goal as a company is to, we make homes and structures more beautiful and more useful with leading edge sustainable products. And they have three PVC Deccan lines, Vintage, Harvest, and the new brand new one, Landmark Collections. Fiberon was started in 1997 with the goal of deck should be enjoyed, not maintained. They have two PVC lines, the Paramount and the Promenade. Both, or all five of their lines, are 100% virgin PVC core material with no real distinct difference between the two. The cap on the other hand, there's a little bit difference. So ASEC is very consistent in cap in all four sides, which all PVC companies, PVC deck and lines do. The big difference with ASEC is they have a textured impost streaking on the one side, the deck side that you use, the top side, but then the bottom is a distinctly different color. It's capped, but it's not there designed to be seen. Fiberon with their Paramount, Roughly the same thing. Textured and impostin on the top, bottom side is capped, but not designed for appearance. The promenade is. So promenade is designed for two-story decks where you get to go up underneath and you can see the underside of the decking. It has actual streaking on it, which you can see really good here with the weathered cliff. The bottom of the cap has actual color variations in streaking. It's not impost like the top, but you can see distinctly colors and enjoy the beauty of the underside of the decking. If you want to learn more about the different color options, of course, you can go to Fiberon or Azec and look at their many different color options, or you can go to DexbyE3.com where I list out all the colors and the collections and the distinctions between the five of them. So in regards to durability, one thing that always pops up is staining. So, I don't know why, but we're all concerned that we're going to have our ketchup on our deck and we're going to end up pouring it on there and that's going to stay in our decking, which is actually was a concern if you had wood decking. With PVC decking, the cap is actually amazing. So amazing that Azac says that you can let that glob of ketchup sit there for a full week and then take your time to wash it off and it still will not stain their deck. And if it does, they'll replace it for you in their warranty. Now, scratch tests, we always do this. Whenever we grab a piece of composite deck, we always try to scratch it, which I'm with Shane from the Ultimate Deck Store. Really, like once the deck is installed, it's not gonna get scratched. But, since we all gotta do the test, I brought something to scratch it. So. If you take the dull edge of a metal object and you rub it across it, you're barely going to see anything. And that's the same both for Fiberon and for Azek. Take the sharp side. If you take a knife to your deck, give her a good scratch. Oh, you can see that one. Oh yeah, there it is. Right there. It's going to scratch. So, if you plan to play with knives on your deck, you're going to get damaged. Don't play with knives on your deck, okay? That's all I got to say about that. There's a little bit of difference in regards to fire rate in between the, the five lines. Azek and not the Paramount, the Promenade all have a class A, which is the highest fire rating you can have of construction material. Last time I tried this, my matches went up, but let's see if we can make it work this time. There we got it. We got fire. 
is a beautiful thing about well, PVC decking. When properly treated, it will not burn. Like it's not fire resistant per se, but the fire rating is very low. The flame spread is the lowest you're gonna get. Unfortunately, for Paramount, it only has a class B as opposed to all the others which have a class A. The difference in the point spread is the others have are rated at 25, which just at the bottom of a class A rating, and Paramount is rated 30, which puts it into class B. But both are safe to use in your urban wildlife interfaces. Another big difference between the two companies is traction. We jump back to our, this is our dark hickory Azek. If you look very closely, the embossing is not very deep. On the other hand, we grab our Paramount here, and you look nice and closely, and the embossing is very deep. And that makes a world of difference for traction for PVC decking. This is gonna give you about three times the more traction when dry, and a fair bit of much more traction when wet. So if you need grip, fiber on deck is the way to go. Everything costs money, PVC deck is no different. Overall, they're all roughly priced the same. You will save a little bit of money buying the Harvest Collection from Azac. I'm only talking like a dollar or so a lineal foot and it depends where you buy it. But Azac Harvest is priced a little bit lower than almost the, all the other PVC decans between these two lines. Not much, but a little bit that you could save a few bucks. In regards to warranty, both Azek and Fiberon give you the same warranty practically. They're both 50 years, so a lifetime structural fade and stain, 100% replacement for the first 10 years. After that, the value depreciates 10% every four years. Till it is gone at 50 years. That's the same for fade, stain, structural. It's all good. You're back by lifetime warranty. So our original question was, which PVC decking is best for you? Now, when I first started my research to write my blog and to do this video for you, I was hoping for a clear winner. Something that I could say, this is the best PVC decking you can buy. That didn't happen. Both Azek and Fiberon make a very good PVC decking board with roughly about the same performance. There are some slight edges on them and we're gonna just refresh on those ones. But largely speaking, they're both very good durable decking which you can install and enjoy on your deck for many years. So slight distinctions between the two. One is Azek in their color collection has some more of the extremes. Take this one, for example. This is Weathered Teak, which is a very light color of blonde. And then we have our, this is our island oak. That's not that dark. Oh, here it is. And we have our dark hickory here. So we have the more extremes in the palette of the colors, giving you a little bit more options in your designs. Where finder on, I find you have two different options. You have a shade of brown and a shade of gray. There's lots of different shades of browns and lots of different shades of gray, but roughly that's your options you're choosing between some neutral colors to build your deck with, but you don't have the extremes that you have in Azek. Another advantage that Azek has over fiber on, as I said, is it's fire rated. So with Promenade, this isn't, it's the same as the Azek. They both have the class A. But with the Paramount, you have a slightly better fire rating if you go with AZ. But we flip over the board and we talk feet instead of fire. Fiber on traction is second almost to none. Especially compared to AZ, they're going to give you way better grip under your feet to enjoy the deck without the fear of slipping than AZ. AZ has some pretty good durable. Decking with some good traction, but fiber on decking is gonna give you better traction overall. Second last thing, like I said, price. If we go to the Harvest Collection, 
you're going to save a few bucks. PVC decking is a premium board, kind of on the higher end of all, all decking prices. But if you need to save a few bucks and still get a lifetime warranty, the Harvest Collection will be there for you. In regards to warranty, like I said, they're both largely the same. A few years ago, we might have been able to say AZEC all the way. Fiberon now matches their warranty, and in their composite line, they exceed their warranty by light years. So they're largely the same. So, maybe in the end of the day, if you can't find a color you love, a deck and board that you're going to enjoy for your lifetime, it's going to come into coins. Let's say tails, Zazek, heads, is Fiberon.